My name is Baden Brumba and I am one of the project leads of Project Revitalize, the community service project for FBLA. Um, I'm Xavier Irvin and the role that I have is uh, the French Club representative. Project Revitalize's goal is to basically reinstitute the paper recycling that we had in the, bu the building a long while ago, as well as bringing in the new composting program that most students have seen in the lunchroom in the past few days. We typically want to have people just kind of dump it into the trash first, and then we put it, uh, all the food and everything else, into the compost, and then you stack your trays on the table next to it. Why start a composting program? The composting program was basically started because we had composting in the coffee shop. We partnered with a company called Larson Supply and they sent us a bunch of compostable coffee cups for free and during that time we wanted to make sure they actually got composted effectively. Now once we did that we basically said why stop there? We need a new community service project and we have a lot of ideas. So why don't we just try doing composting throughout the whole building instead of limiting ourselves to just the coffee shop. So different groups such as NHS, French Club, Sophomore Senate and ROTC have all been major partners in this project. Um, they've committed by having uh, leaders in theirs, leaders in their clubs and things come to interviews and, and things like that, um, coming to newspapers and helping with our interviews and making sure that the community and people who are writing these articles really know that the whole school is involved in this. They've also stepped up and volunteered during our lunch hours um, and they've spent a lot of time talking with us to make sure that they stay informed so they can let their groups know what's going on so their members can also help as well. Last week we got I think it was 550 pounds in total out of our 950 of both composting and trash and it averages out to about 110 pounds a day. This project creates an impact for FBLA because we're allowed to use it in our competitions. Uh, we do a state competition and if we do well enough we make it to a national competition that this year is in Salt Lake City. We write a 15 page report about our project and basically everything that's happened as well as do a presentation in front of a panel of judges to get a score. So for the FBLA impact it's allowing us to compete for awards and recognition for such a big project.